Hey, guess where we are again? We are heading up to the Nasu house, which we're going to start calling um, the house because it's just weird calling it the Nasu house all the time. This time we have the car completely packed up with a bunch of starter stuff. <laughs> we're gonna try and spend our first night at the house and see how that goes. We've got the aero bed that's already up there and uh, hopefully the internet's working when we get up there. I've got a, the old iMac in the, in the back and a bunch of other stuff. So we'll see how this goes. It's really hot outside. 38 degrees. 38 degrees Celsius. In one kilometer, go straight on towards Litinamia. I know I was getting interrupted by that lady. Anyways, so we are still driving. And it's cooled down a little bit. It was really hot. It was. stuck in the normal traffic but we're almost there there's a world of records apparently it's a coffee shop and a record store and a beer store hey, you know we should go there because I like records and beer and I don't know what those things are on that bench there but anyways it's called world records but anyways, yeah, so we're almost to the house, stuck in traffic, looking forward to, hey, there's a barbershop. Uh, yeah, anyways, and we just noticed that there's a ski resort, so maybe we'll go skiing. Not this time, but some other time. And we're getting close. Proceed about two kilometers to your destination. I was gonna say there was the office over there, but I keep getting interrupted by that. And it's actually a little bit getting on my nerves. But anyways, we're almost back up here at the house again. And uh, this will be the first time we're spending the night and actually dropping some stuff off. Actually, I think the curtains might be installed. So we might be able to see those for the first time. But then next week, we're going to come back again. And uh, I'm keeping my eyes peeled this time for monkeys. And there's, there's now there's monkey pox. And in, in the news, there's been monkeys that have been marauding, as they say, into people's houses. So hopefully not up here, though. Hopefully up here, they're, they're nice monkeys. Good monkey. Don't, don't be a bad monkey. Just listen to the bugs. Okay, well, we pulled up to the house and we were not expecting this, but they started building out the deck. And there was some people here working on it. So the deck has gotten a lot bigger, which is great, but we were not expecting them to be doing construction this weekend. And then also we got into the house, which I'll show a little bit later, and the curtains hadn't been installed yet. Um, they were supposed to have already been installed. And then we got attacked by bees when we pulled in earlier right there. Ah, sir, driveway. Nana has gone down to the office to pick up our vacuum that was delivered to the, to the, to the Nasu office 
And now the curtain people are here installing the curtains while we're here. Which I guess is okay, but that means we have to keep our masks on while we're in the house because it's crazy COVID time. Uh, but yeah, so some of the lighting's installed up there. I'll, I'll go inside in a minute, but I was just outside for a second to help Nana get down to the office and get the car backed out. So I just came outside after being inside so I could take my mask off. There's a guy who's installing the curtains in the house at the moment. And it's extremely hot and extremely humid out here, but I need to take off my mask and consume a beer. And then take a look at the deck extension, which was also in progress when we arrived today. But yeah, actually, you know, it's pretty good size. I thought it was going to be too small, but this is actually perfect. So, you know, uh, that's not my car. That's the curtain guy's car. Nana's actually at the grocery store figuring out what we're going to have for dinner. <clears throat> that's back looking into the house there. I'm just outside where I can take my mask off, but it's really buggy. And I don't want to get bit by my mosquitoes. Or we had flew into a storm of bees when we first drove up. It was crazy. It was like bees everywhere. So, anyways, this is this is <laughs> this is the, this is progress. So yeah, I'm gonna drink my beer now. Yeah, can't believe this is not what I expected. Okay, well, today did not turn out the way that we expected it to. Place is kind of a mess, and that's okay. Uh, we're getting used to it. When we got here today, there was a guy working out on the deck, and the curtains had not yet been installed, and now I'm second-guessing our curtain choices but uh so the curtains were installed today and they would have they should have been done already but uh the bedroom is still not a bedroom but the lamp is in there and it has curtains now and it's a bunch of crap laying everywhere but it's starting to feel like more normal so yeah, it's like Nana's desk is gonna go over there and some stuff against the wall, yeah. And the air conditioner's working. And it's, that it's actually feels kind of normal in here and not at all like the Nasu house of the past. So yeah, couch is in here. We have temporary furniture all over the place. AC units in there, but yeah, <clears throat> it's got it's got the potential that we're looking for, and, and we have internet now, which is good. And this lamp that I bought a while back is not where I wanted to go, and that dehumidifier doesn't really belong there. But it's just everything's just kind of temporary in right now. So, tonight we'll be sleeping on the aero bed. But yeah, so the internet's the internet's are working, which is kind of cray. And I get to keep my old really cool, awesome phone that I wanted to make sure that I kept. Can't really see outside in the balcony because it's a little too bright in here. But. Uh, the deck is actually out there and it's bigger than it was before. So I'll shoot some video tomorrow when it's not dark and you can see the place better. I got all the track lighting installed today, which I'm gonna have to go up there and then adjust all of them. I'm standing on the top of the ladder. 
Hopefully I won't kill myself by falling off. We're all just picking out kitchen racks and stuff like that for where do we put the dishes? Anyways.